Hi, my name's Steve Lards, and just want to do a quick video about us, the human batteries. Basically, everything in this world is energy. Everything vibrates at a frequency, and it's all about the energy. So I know with myself that when I feel charged and I'm around other people radiating energy, I feel charged and I give them energy, they give me energy back. And I am full of life, I am full of ideas, I am fully connected to the universe, I feel great. Um, when I go around people who don't know how to generate their own energy, now I've heard a lot of derogatory terms for these people, I don't like to use any of them. They are just the way they are there. It's, believe me, if anyone could radiate their own energy, they'd be a lot happier. Some people just don't know how. They don't choose to drain others by choice. It's because they're low frequency and mind based. But we don't judge them for this. We try and help them if and when they're ready. So with the energy, when you feel flat, like if I, if I get flattened by someone and with someone I start feeling tired, I feel withdrawn, I feel lethargic, things get me down easier, I start going low frequency myself, I am not charged. When I'm around positive people or I'm in nature, I'm connected, I'm coming out of my mind, I'm starting to feel more charged, I feel full of life, I, and as I say, the ideas, the creativeness, everything comes flowing through, I am at one. So, it's important to understand this, so we can read our energy. So when we feel like we're getting drained by someone who can't produce their own energy, we, we have to have a time out, we have to go and recharge ourselves, but we need to be aware of the signs. What we don't do is go, God, that person, they're an energy vampire, or they're this, or they're that, and a because that isn't gonna charge us. That's negativity, because we feel low energy. So we're vibrating lower, so now we're getting moany and negative ourselves, and we're attracting that, which makes us complain. What we need to do is go, take a breath, maybe not like that, <laughs> maybe a bit more dignified, um, Take a breath, take a time out, and recharge yourself before you get too low. Once you start feeling yourself getting moany or negative, your frequency is dropping. You need to come away from the situation, however that happens, do it politely and do it calmly, and just go and recharge. Take time for yourself, maybe meditate, go for a walk, before you get to that point, and just recharge yourself. Or speak to someone who you know, is also an energy giver, someone who's aware and conscious of energy and they can radiate. And then this way, go and charge up off them. It doesn't mean dump the problems on them. Don't start moaning about the person, they're this and they're that and they're whatever else. You just go and speak to them, speak about ideas. You've got things that are positive, things that you're looking forward to and just generate that energy between yourself until you feel good again, until you feel charged and positive and then you start vibrating and then you start attracting things. This is important for us to know, especially as empaths, and especially for anybody, because we are all energy. And we need to understand the energy aspect of us, because all we're ever taught in school and education is the mind-based and the physical-based. We're never taught about our soul and our energy and our love and our need to charge, and why we, we get into certain thought patterns and we get into certain situations, because our energies have dropped. Now, to recharge our energy, we need to eat nutritious food. I've mentioned this before. Um, once again, we don't judge people by what they eat. We all do what we are doing on our path. We are all in the perfect time and place for our journey. And we don't judge others for where they are at their journey. We accept it. And if they're ready to, to level up or to, to move forward a little bit on their path, we offer them light or we shine a beacon if they're far back so they can see where to head towards. But we need to protect our energy. So we do this by recharging. Timeouts, grounding, protecting, visualizations, affirmations, and just understanding when we can feel that energy drop and to recharge it. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it on this video. I just wanted to, to clarify this a little bit for people, um, just so you can think outside the mind rather than what the mind tells you. It's more about a feeling and a knowing. Okay, love and light. I wish you all a great day. Morning, evening, noon, night, wherever you are. Thank you for the taking the time to listen. Thank you, bye.